What's up, Facebook fam? I hope all is well in your corner of the world. Uh, man, a lot of people in the comment section have been telling me, yo, get check out Marlon Craft's new album. Uh, we started breaking down uh, Marlon Craft last year when I, I came across Gang Shit. And uh, man, his stuff was deep. So uh, really excited to get back into this. Uh, looks like, uh, let's see, this is the first track. It looks like a small album. There's only six tracks on it. Uh, so we might be able to get into the entire album here. This is uh, the first track, I believe, called Marlin Craft, I Still Don't Cry. Uh, so let's get into it. looks like he has an official video for this. All right, that's not him, but it uh, looks like this is the song. So, yo, let's check it out. Let's get right into it. What is that, the keyboard? Scratching is a last I still start. don't cry enough. I still be trying to be tough. I still tell lies too much to the mirror. I don't look me in the eyes enough. I still be dying too much. I still don't cry. You know, and I think when we were learning about Marlon Kraft before, I believe he's someone who has always struggled with, uh, uh, I don't want to say mental health, but uh, like depression, right? There's definitely a very depressed vibe for this. Um, but I still don't cry. This is actually in uh, a lot of men feel this way, right? What does our music soul child say? I was told the true definition of a man was to never cry. Work till you die. Got to provide. Always be the rock for my fam, right? So it's, it's ingrained in us uh, from just hip hop to R&B to just you gotta you gotta walk tall. You gotta be this man, right? Um, so uh, very interested to see where he goes with this. I'm back a few seconds here. I don't look me in the eyes enough. I still fear dying too much. I still don't cry. I still don't cry. Lord knows I try. Is this the chorus or is I this the don't cry? Is he flowing? I just wanna be better sometimes. No, it sounds simple, I know. Waiting on me to change. I get fed up, make better decisions. I grow way down by the shit that I know. Paralyzed by the shit that I feel. Propel you know, that's some very real that's <laughs> a very real statement he said, right? Um it, it, he said he, he gets fed up, right? But he said he's weighed down by the shit that he knows um and it's like as you start to dive deeper and go down the rabbit hole with conspiracy theories and the imperfections of the world and uh, the perpetuation of uh you know contributing to the delinquency of minors or to the perpetuation of racism and you start going down this path and it makes you sad because you realize how um how effed up this planet really is and the the really the systems in place to hold down groups, extremely large groups of people. And, you know, you go around and you have these conversations with friends or coworkers and they don't get it. And a lot of people simply don't care. Right. Uh, you look at uh, the city of Chicago just had an election for mayor. They got out Lori Lightfoot and you ask people, Hey, did you guys vote? Or, Hey, did you see that Lori Lightfoot, uh, first time an incumbent lost and Bob and people are like, oh, I don't, it doesn't affect me. And it's like, <laughs> you know, so, so many people, um, you know, what do they say? Ignorance is bliss, right? Sometimes knowing too much and we know Marlon Kraft gets it. I know from the breakdown of his other music, um, he gets it. Sometimes it could be too much. It could, it could weigh heavy on you. Fell by the shit that I fear. It's saying how to be living, my dear. Give me my beer, give me my crush, give me your excuse. Give me my crutch, right? Give me my, give me my smoke, give me my some broad day. I'm a real pro. Whisper my truth, keep it real low. Damn. Hard to hear from back on your heels. Pay the cost, do of every tear untold. I still don't cry enough. I still be trying to be tough. I still tell lies too much to the mirror. Yo, me in the eyes. again, I, I know I, I referenced this, but my favorite poem, uh, this is why it means so much to me. It's called The Man in the Mirror. Um, 
and I'll repeat it here, and I encourage you guys. I used to print it, and I used to have it around, and you, you look at it, um, and it just makes you remember why you do certain things. So this is the way the poem goes. It says, it's called The Man in the Mirror or The Man Looking in the Mirror or something like that. It says, when you get all you want in your, in your struggle for self and the world makes you king for a day, uh, then go to the mirror and look at yourself and see what that man has to say. For it isn't your mother or father or wife whose judgment upon you must pass, but the man whose verdict counts most in your life is the one looking back through the glass. Um, he's the fellow to please, never mind all the rest, because he's with you right to the end, and you pass your most difficult test if the man in the glass is your friend. Uh, and now they have some other references, like you might be like Jack Horner and chisel a plum and think you're a wonderful guy, uh, but the man in the glass says you're only a bum if you can't look him straight in the eye. You can fool the whole world, down the highway of years and get pats on the back as you pass. But your final reward, reward will be headache and tears if you cheated the man in the glass. And it means so much. It's like you have to be true to yourself. And we, you, you hear this a lot in history, right? Look back at um, uh, Michael Jackson, right? I'm looking at the man in the mirror. He's telling me to change my ways, right? Something along those lines. But the man in the mirror means so much. And a lot of people just overlook that. They're so concerned about what other people think that they're not worried about what they think of themselves. Enough, I still fear dying too much. I still don't cry. I Damn. still don't cry. I still don't, I still don't cry. Lord knows I try. I still don't cry. Is that it? Maybe it's just an intro into the album. Mm, breaking it down. Doesn't it feel good? Let it out. Let it out, homie. Big homie. Look like he dropped his lunch tray. Oh, I ran out of weed today. What am I? My beard don't line up. I got a patch. My line is up here. Lost my glasses. I don't have a ponytail clip, face says. Nice. Yo, I'm, I'm a fan of Marlon Craft. Don't get me talking shit. It's Monday morning. I, I'm a big shit talker. But, uh, man, if you guys are fans of Marlon Craft, this is a little dark for my liking. But we've heard some of his other music, man. Just great breakdowns. Very intellectual cat. I love his story. If you guys are fans of Marlon Kraft, go down. I have a whole folder dedicated to his work and breaking down his work. And show some love, man. We're trying to grow the channel. We got to 1,000 subscribers rather quick. But make sure you share it in your Reddit areas and social media. I want to make sure if you're a fan of the work that we're doing and these great intellectual in-depth breakdowns, we want to make sure that we have a good community here. We can bounce ideas off each other, check out new artists. Man, show some love, and we'll see you on the next video.